Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Michelle and I'm Elvis Hassie on YouTube. I'm making a few videos in this dress today, so you'll notice that I'm wearing the same clothes. This is a quick look at my top five albums. Now, I've done album covers and that was um, a couple of weeks ago or maybe a month ago or so. And um, I couldn't get it down. I was done a 15 minute video. I just made it to like everyone I liked. This time I've been strict and this is now my favourite Elvis albums from his lifetime. And um, these are my favourites because of the songs that are on there. And I've been strict. It's been hard. Yeah, I've got five of my favourites. But they're all my favourites, but let's not go there. I try and whiz through them so that um, we don't spend lots of times like the last video, which was like way too long. So we're going to start straight away. My ultimate favourite album of all time. There is no better, in my opinion. Is Elvis is back? Do you agree? <laughs> Put down in the comments below. I love this. This is number one. This is what I play on my Apple Music most days when I walk to my mum's. It takes me 20 minutes to walk to my mum's and 20 minutes back. I listen to this most of the time. Or I am always Elvis Radio. But most of the time it's this. I just absolutely love it. And also Elvis in Nashville. That new one that came out. I have that on my Apple Music as well. So I listen to that a lot too recently. But yeah, this is unbelievable. This is so, so good. Um, This is the sleeve for it. Okay, so Elvis's back is, um, it went gold. It went to number two in the pop chart, which is bonkers. This is all in America and this is not in the UK. Um, so the songs we have on it were Make Me Know It, Fever, The Girl and My Best Friend, I'll Be Home Again, Dirty Dirty Feeling, Thrill of Your Love, Soldier Boy, Such a Night, It Feels So Right, Girl Next Door Went A Walk In, Like A Baby, Reconsider Baby. Now, I just absolutely love that. All of those songs to me are just glorious. I mean, my probably my favourite from that is, oh, I can't pick it. I, I love the Thrill of Your Love, Like a Baby. I just love her. I have to do that soon. Reconsider Baby, Girl Next Door Went A Walk In. There's just so many classics in it and I just absolutely love it. So it's my absolute number one and I love it. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to move on to number two for me. And this had to be an early one for Elvis. And it's this one. Now, of course, I put in favourite artwork. I mentioned this, but I didn't put it in my top five or my top ten. Did I? Or did I maybe put it in my top ten? This is my second favourite for um, songs on the album. This is just absolutely brilliant. We've got Rip It Up, Love Me, When My Blooming Turns to Gold Again, Long Tall Sally, First in Line, Paralyzed, So Glad You're Mine, Old Shep, Brady Terry, Any Place is Paradise, How's the World Treating You, How Do You Think I Feel? Now, that is just an unbelievable great album and i absolutely love it so um the peak position was number one for this i think it's iconic the cover and um, we've got songs that are just so amazing on there and um i don't know what my favorites could be but maybe so glad you're mine first in line um any place paradise i just love them all and i think it's a real brilliant 50s album so it was his second ever album and i think for song wise it completely is better than the first one but I like the other one's artwork. So yeah, it's just, but I love it and I think it's great. So this has to be my number two. Okay, so I had to put in a soundtrack album because I am a big massive Elvis movie fan and I love the Elvis movies, every single one. So I was thinking, right, out of all the soundtrack albums, which is the one that you would go and listen to whenever you feel like it? And it has to be on an Acapulco. Now, it's not in my top five of favourite movies, but it's well up there because I love it. I could watch it any day. But the f album is fantastic. And why I picked this as well is when I'm at my Elvis events, these songs come on. I'm on the dance floor within two seconds flat because I absolutely love it. Now, its peak chart position was number three in the pop and it was released in 1963. And um, the songs on here, Fun in Acapulco, Fino de Nero Amor, um, Mexico, El Toro, Margarita, The Bullfighter Was a Lady, There's No Room to Rumba, I Think I'm Gonna Like It Here, Bossing Over Baby, You Can't Say No in Acapulco, Guadalajara, Love Me Tonight, Slowly But Surely. So they're obviously the bonus ones. Um, and I just absolutely love it. I think it's a fantastic album and I think it's brilliant songs and every time they come on I want to dance to them, I want to enjoy them. So I had to pick this and I had to pick a soundtrack album. So this is my third favourite album of all of Elvis's 
but it was hard to pick on the soundtracks because I wanted to pick Spin Out. I wanted to pick, um, oh my gosh, so many of the soundtracks. I can like pick so many. You know, you know I'm going to love the soundtracks. But I've only included one in my top five. So yeah, and it's fantastic. It's on my Apple playlist and I play it regularly. Okay, so for number four, it is Good Times, Elvis Good Times album. Now, I just absolutely love this song. Now, it was peak position was number 90 in the pop, number five in country, and it was released in 74. Now, there's some classics on here. This is how it looks. The back looks like that. It's just really understated. I like that. I think it's nice. Um, Take good care of her. Love in arms. I got a feeling in my body. If that isn't love, she wears my ring. I've got a thing about you, baby. My boy. Spanish eyes. Talk about the good times. The good time Charlie's got the blues. Oh. Now, in 1974, if I was around and I saw this come out, I would faint getting to know those songs. I truly... I, I'm a 70s girl, so these take over the earlier. But... I just absolutely love this and this is maybe more my second favourite rather than my fourth favourite yeah these top five are just in general because <laughs> they change all the time and if you were to easily tomorrow if you asked me I maybe would change my mind again but I don't think the good times would ever change I love this album I think it's brilliant Um, there's so many good things it was recorded at Stax I mean the Stax album Um, I don't know if anyone got that I'll put a picture of it here the Stax album me and my husband listen to it like crazy people. I just absolutely love that album. The Stax recordings are by far awesome. So yeah, the Good Times has got to be in there. I love it. It's fantastic. Wow. Great Elvis album. Okay, my last one from my top five be the iconic Moody Blue. Now, I just love this. I love the cover. I love everything about it. I think the songs on here are amazing and it gives us a taste of what Elvis was um, about to do and I think the next album would have been even better. I just I just love it. Um, Moody Blue um, peak chart position was number three in pop, number one in country. It became two times platinum. It was amazing songs on here. Unchained Melody. If you let me if you love me, let me know. Little Darling, he'll have to go. Let me be there. Way down. Pledge of my love. Moody Blue. She still thinks she thinks I still care and it's easy for you. Now, I love all of those songs, all of those I listen to regular, and I just love going back to this album, Pledging My Love being my favourite on there, but then I love Moody Blue, she thinks I still care, I love that, I listen to that awesomely all the time, Let Me Be There and If You Love Me are the songs that I get up to dance to at the Elvis Dance Like a Crazy Person, I just love it, He'll Have to Go is really cool and just different kind of song, I love that, Way Down is genius, it's really pop, it's that was going to, that was, well, it was a hit, but obviously Elvis was gone. So um, what it would have been, I think it, it's a brilliant song, brilliant pop record. So yeah, I just absolutely love Moody Blue. So that is why. So yeah, and I've used my trusty um, little album collection just to show you because we've got the artwork, so we may as well. So yeah. So in recap, my favourites are Elvis is back. Elvis number two album, Fun in Acapulco, so I had to get in a soundtrack album, so that's the one. The Good Times by Elvis, and I think it might be up there with Elvis's back really, after I've just talked about it, and Moody Blue. These are my top five. Now, I've left out a heck of a lot of albums. Look, how can you get these to top five? It's just ridiculous, there's too many good ones. But it's nice to chat about it, and nice to go over them, and I love these ones. So yeah, what are your favourite top five? Put down in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts and I shall speak to you on another video very soon. Bye everyone.